don't like it. We can see him do this all day. We can see him do this all day. We can see him do this all day. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Scott Jordan here. In this video, I got a brand new hoodie, man. Boys in a hood hoodie, man. I you know I got hoodies on deck. I'm going to be showing you how to quick punch in Logic Pro X like you would in Pro Tools. You know what I'm saying? It's a better way to record in Logic Pro than vocal company. If you're not in the vocal company, you just want to quick punch. Punch in, you know, record like Gunna, The Baby, The Baby, um, NBA Young Boy. All your favorite rappers, they most likely they punch in. You feel me? They quick punch. And I'm going to show you how you do that in Logic Pro X like you would in Pro Tools. Look, but before we jump into the video, I got to let you know this video is sponsored by DistroKid. Before I put you on game, I got to let you know what DistroKid got going on over here, man. So they have streaming service goodies, man. And what these goodies are, man, it's not food. It's not snacks, bro. It's... We got Spotify for artists. We got Apple Music for artists. We got the official artist YouTube channel here. And we got the allow list right here, right? It's very crucial to have a verified Spotify account, bro. That helps you stand out, man. Look more professional, right? Because you are an independent artist and you want to look professional. When it comes to managing your profile, man, I'm talking about your bio. Profile pictures, you get a banner. Really sauce up your bio, man. Look really professional compared to the competition out there man because you want to do the extra things the small things that the competition not going to do all right you want to look official before you become official yeah you know what i'm saying like that um and also man you get to learn about your listeners man you get to see what cities what countries are streaming your music the most you got apple music for artists man so you get two birds with one stone honestly apple music and spotify and what apple music for artists allows you to do man you know you get to hit your milestones it keeps track of that you get to find out who your listeners are and where they at same thing bro like data is very important bro you want to know where your fans are like a lot of people want to be verified man and this is how you become verified but look man i'm finna show you i had a quick punch let's get back to the video all right man you want to go to logic pro x you want to go down to key commands you want to go to presets and you see on the spanish up here man spanish german french japanese swedish nah bro we're going to pro tools so we click pro tools cool and right then we hit ignore all right so what this allows us to do is use our pro tool shortcuts with some of them and but this one is the main one to be able to record right and what we're going to do we're going to go a little extra we're going to take this off we're going to turn this off turn this off keep that off when we're recording turn it off turn the catch play head off um do you want to go up here to record you want to go to overlapping audio recordings when the cycle is off you want to click create track alternative and what the cycle is is this right here all right we don't want to record with the cycle on unless you want to record like that so if you're recording with the cycle on, you want to go back and do the same thing. Create track alternative. So we record. All right, we're recording. We good, we good, we good, we good, we good. And we good, we good, we good, we good, we good, we good, we good. We good, we good, we good, we good, we good. So what that does is it makes different playlists for us, right? It makes different playlists. So we have different playlists cool so you just got to remember what takes you do this is different from the vocal comp and thing but you're not going to be able to re-record over it and you're just going to have to vocal comp and chop and do all the extra editing right yeah 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 so we here we here we here we here we good we good we good we good we here we here we good we good good we good ha, ha, ha. so now we got a whole vocal take right here a whole stack right and we really can't quick punch this way so don't do this take this off so we're gonna go back go back in track alternative because quick punching man it's basically man it's meant for you to kind of like record quick and the thing about it is um you always want to make sure you hit space before you do it you want to drag and drop hit space what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna quick punch a little bit i'm quick punch a hook and show you how to do it Shiny, shiny on the door. Shiny on the door. All right, so bring it down. We hit space. We went back to the top. Shiny, shiny on the door. 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 All right, so we bring it down. All right, we bring it down. 
We in space, we gon' get to the top Shiny, shiny run it up Shiny run it up Shiny run it up Just create, you know what I'm saying? This is how you quick punch, man. Like in Pro Tools, all you basically doing is just recording over something. So I'm gonna mute the beat. So it's like basically we just gonna record, right? And so we just recording, 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 recording. So whatever we wanna keep that, we drag that down. Like we like that part. We wanna pick up at basically it. we just gonna record. So we just recording, 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 recording. You know what I'm saying? So whatever we wanna keep that. Then we wanna come back in like this. All right, so they be like, yeah, keep that, you know what I'm saying? Bring that down, cool. Then they be like, you know, record that shit again. Bring me back. Basically, right. we just gonna record, right? And so we just recording, 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 recording. So whatever, we wanna keep that. Then we wanna come back in like this. And then it's like, it's all good. Like we can sit here and just do this as we much as we want to. We want. You know, so um, like when it comes to Using quick punch, this is the easiest way to quick punch in Logic Pro, especially like Pro Tools. But the thing about it is, whenever you bringing stuff down, you gonna have to be careful because if you get it off, off, off whatever tab you got it on, it's gonna be off, man. You know, so you get it off, off key, off beat. You gonna have to put it back on beat. Basically, we just gonna record, right? And so we just recording, 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 recording. So whatever we wanna keep that. Then we want to come back in like this. And then it's like, it's all good. Like, we can sit here and just do this as much as we want to. All right, because people on the outside, man, to them, they might be like, oh, it sounds like he did that in one take. But reality, you probably punched a bunch of times. You know what I'm saying? You punched in. That's how quick punching is. You know what I'm saying? It's punching in. And I just showed you the easy way to do it in Logic Pro X, especially to do it kind of like Pro Tools. This is like the easiest way, you know what I'm saying, to use Pro Tools shortcuts. In Logic Pro X and Quick Punch, so you know. So what I'm gonna, I'm gonna run through it one more time, one more time. So what you wanna do? Go to Key Commands, choose Pro Tools, right? Choose Pro Tools. That's what you wanna do. All right. Then you go from Pro Tools. You wanna go to Record. Go to Overlapping Audio Recordings. Create Track Alternative on both of those, right? This is only if you wanna Quick Punch, right? So you wanna make your record track, all right? And you wanna be able to record. You know, so when you record, command space, right? It's gonna record. Command space is gonna record. And after you done, hit space. You know, after you done, drag it down, hit space. It's gonna play it. And then while it's playing, you command space again. And when you hit command space again, it's gonna record. And you just pick up after that and repeat. You just edit as you go. You know what I'm saying? It's really, really easy, man. It's it's not that hard. But listen, make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel. Um, if you have any problems trying to set this up, just make sure you pay attention to what you're doing and what I'm doing. And if you're not doing it the right way, just let me know, man. I'm going to try my best to help you, right? 
But make sure you like, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's your boy Sky Join. I'm out of here. All right? Cool? Cool.